So today guys we are in Cypher Lisbon and we're gonna go on a little adventure today. We're going to a national park. Some we're going to the noise you now, I'm trying to do a vlog. So we're gonna to go to the national park. What's the name of the national park? Parque Nacional de do Ahabida. Ahabida. We have a car and we're gonna try and drive over there. Um, I think I'm the designated driver, aren't I? Are you gonna drive? Yeah. No, it's gonna be me driving. I'm not a big fan of this car, but it should be an adventure anyway. And yeah, once we get there, I'll show you guys around. So uh, let's do it. We're just stopping off at Praia de Galapos. Or Galapa. So we're gonna walk down to the beach and have a look. I think it's like an un unsupervised beach, so it's kind of quiet. Um, there's probably not many people there. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't know what it looks like, but we just kind of like driving along. We just stopped off because we just seen this view over here. Um, and yeah, from here, we're kind of guessing that down there somewhere is going to be a nice beach. Yeah, that was the beach. It's a really beautiful beach. I was like super impressed. Um, just the waters are all clear. It's very quiet. And there's even a cat. Where we're staying in Almada, which is south of Lisbon, like near the city. It's not near the sea, but it's close to the sea. This location is about a 45 minute drive. So I guess you could say like this location here is around about an hour's drive from Lisbon, 45 minute drive. Um, so yeah, super close. I had no idea that Lisbon had like beaches like this so close I, I thought it had like just some beaches but i didn't think they were like really beautiful or anything this whole area this whole national park is very impressive um i didn't did not have any idea that lisbon had this in in the region so um yeah very impressed heading off to a viewpoint next don't know what the viewpoint is don't know what it's called um i'll get the name to you Pochinho. that's all we know Dahibida. I think that's probably one of the most popular spots here in this national park. You can see it's quite busy. Crazy how like the temperature changes from where we just were at the beach to coming up to this high. It's super windy up here, it's quite cold. I think it's about 500 meters high, so it is quite high. Very beautiful scenery though. And again, super impressed that this is all like so close to Lisbon. Anyway, it's time to drive back to the casa and uh, Still can for me, so I'm gonna try and find some frango asado. This is what we have guys, very very typical Portuguese frango asado, picante e arroz e arroz So this is it This is the dinner That's it for today 
Bobo Domingo. It's a very good Sunday, enjoyed it very much. First proper day in this part of Portugal, Lisbon. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to showing you guys more of the rest of the week. Bom dia, hoje é um dia um pouco tédio, tedioso. Estou trabalhando uh, em casa, so I don't really have much going on today. I'm gonna walk down to the beach later because there's supposed to be a beach like five, like a ten minute walk from here. So I'm gonna go down there later, which I'm gonna show you guys. But for now, it's just gonna be working, just working for the day. I have to know. No? I have so many sangrias. Exactly. What I think is go for a run. What time is it? It's 5 pm. So, so we... go in at 5 30 now because it's going to be too hot now. <laughs> yeah, 30 minutes can make a big difference. Go for a run, come back, shower, and then find food. No? Going for a run is also exploring because we haven't seen like the beach around here yet. Keep all the ash. Acho perfeito. Straight out of bed, um, I've been editing since. I've got a lot, lot to do, a lot to do, and it's not for YouTube, unfortunately. It's for other work, and it's lunchtime. So again, pesci, pesci for hamosso. I'm just trying to season it at the moment. I'm trying to find some herbs. I've got some garlic on there, garlic paste, some of this fake masaji aglio. Um, I don't know what to put on it. I don't know what this is. Salt in there. Yeah, I guess so. Not like, yeah, it's so guys, super busy day today. Might as never run by this wonderful beach, and again, it's an evening to find fish. But yeah, day done, Wednesday, no, Tuesday done, and uh. Complete. Post run pitching. Foi muito bom, muito bom. I cut salmon earlier and I came here and I thought I'm not going to have salmon again, but I couldn't resist. Was the salmon here better than what I cooked earlier? Definitely. Uh, I have to say I'm very impressed with the fish in Portugal. Very impressed. Three days to my flight to Brazil. Today we have to take the PCR test which we're going to use to get onto our flight to Brazil. Of course this is the second test we've had to take. The first one was to get into Portugal and now this one's to get into Brazil. I'm nervous, you know, because this test has to be negative. Again, obviously it has to be negative. I'm going to go there in 30 minutes fingers crossed again that it is negative and then that will be it all clear to go to Brazil. It's the last hurdle already isn't it apart from the flight, just need to get on the flight then. But yeah got to do that today and then after I'm going to film a video uh, for my channel with our friends. It'll be about Portuguese snacks, looks like Brazilian snacks so it's going to be a cool video to make uh, so we're going to make that later this evening but yeah that's it for today, another day in Portugal.
Thank you. 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 As you can see before in my previous video, for me it was alright actually. I quite enjoyed it. A little tickle at the nose, it didn't really bother me too much. Um, it already feels a bit weird, but it wasn't bad. I'll do it again. Any time of the week. So, yeah, that's complete. And now we have to wait for our results, which should come this evening. But now that's done, I'm happy. I'll let you know what the results is as soon as we get them. So, just got the test results back. It's negativo. That's the next step. That will allow me to get onto the airplane to Brazil. So yeah, that's it. On to Saturday. Ironically, today I just found out that now they've changed the rules and you can actually go direct from England to Brazil from this day onwards. So, <laughs> seems like there was actually, didn't need to come to Portugal, but I came anyway and Everything happens for a reason. I'm really enjoying being here. So I've got no complaints. It is what it is. And, you know, I'm still going to come to Brazil on Saturday. So tonight we went to our friends and we did some more filming. We did the video about Portuguese and Brazilian snacks. I'm very full now. Um, yeah. But that's going to be a very good video, um, so I'm excited to show you that video very soon. But for now, that's it. Quatro feira. Finished. Acabou. Boa noite. Até amanhã. Tchau. Bom dia. Hoje é quinta-feira. Mais um dia. One day closer to Brazil. Hoje é dia. Um... Lava a roupa. Is that right? Yeah, we're gonna go to Lisbon tonight for the first time all week because we've been just on the outside of Lisbon so we've not even gone into the city. Just been really busy and occupied with other stuff so we've not really had a chance to do that. But we're gonna do that today. I'll show you some, some bits around Lisbon as well. But yeah, just washing clothes, bit of editing and uh, on to Lisbon. Mais uma gira na praia. Ah, I love that beach. Running around on that beach. Love it. More could you ask for? For our most soul. And what do we have today? We have frango. Frango asado. Bought oh, this from the supermarket. We have salada as well. It's a strange one. It has a con noses. The queijo de cabra. It's so goat's cheese in English and I think it's hazelnut. Hazelnut in English. So yeah, we're gonna try and <laughs> put that together and see how that is. So that'll be it for the afternoon. Continue to do a bit more editing for my vlog and then over to Lisbon. So I spent most of the afternoon editing. I'm trying to do as much as I can, but yeah. The flight's getting closer and closer and I'm just getting a little bit more anxious. Tomorrow I have to pack my stuff up again, which I hate doing. And then it's like, tomorrow is Friday and the flight is on Saturday. So yeah, feeling anxious, but we're just about to head out to Lisbon now. So I'm gonna try and uh, chill, have a beer and chill.
so today is Friday, tomorrow flight to Brazil. So yeah, busy day today for me, stressful day, a little bit anxious about this flight because uh, I just don't like them, you know, I just don't like airports, suitcases and stuff. But we've packed our suitcases. Yeah, there's suitcases, we've still got one more to put a few more things in. And now we're just gonna go down to the beach one last time in Portugal to watch the sunset. Let's do it. Sunset time it is. Let's go. So one hour in Brazil and I'm ironing my trousers to go to a, uh, a wedding party. I got some lip filler, came to Brazil and got some lip filler in my first four hours. 